I'm um, uh, Don Robinson, and, and I I, um, I started lear learning um, uh, in about uh, 1948. At, no, uh, no, 1956. 1956. Um, uh, 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 every uh, when I was age eight, and I used to go um, up to um, Old Man Vivian every night after school for a, a year or so, um, uh, having, having lessons. And then uh, uh, I found the trumpet, the cornet was too hard for me, it wasn't getting on too well, so I went on the tenor horn, and ev evidently my mother tells me I, um, I took off. <laughs> and, and then I was on the tenor horn there for a few years, and then just about the time I went to high school, I, I asked if I'd go back onto Cornet. So then, then I, um, I did, I did play in the um, Thames High School uh, brass band um, in about 1962 and 63, and then um, then that stopped going. And th th but then I carried on with, with, the, with the band, and all the good players were starting to leave, and that, and I ended up on the solo corner in the Kirapay band around about uh, age 16, and then um, went right through till I was about uh, 20, age 24, and and and, and uh, at that stage I was wanting to get get away from the banding movement. There's no no one my age in it, so went down to South Island. Uh, 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 for about three years, and I came back, and then um, my parents were living in Thames, and I, uh, 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 one of the conductor, came around with a corner, and you heard I was back, <laughs> and then uh, I got back into it uh, when I was about 20, um, 28, and uh, suddenly I was hooked, and uh, I, I took off from there, and um, and and then. Um, Went back to Kirapay Band too, and then I left Tenth Band in the finish end, end of Kira. Uh, oh, the uh, Nati a Kirapay Band didn't like the trumpet in the um, brass band, Kirapay Band, so um, I, I left and give it up for a while, and then um, I eventually went up to Auckland in different bands, and then I came back and. Uh, with the re reunion and the Kirapay band, maybe I don't know, five, six years ago, or so, uh, and uh, uh, I've stayed, been here ever since. Yeah. But what, what are some highlights, Don? Um, well, um, one, one was a, a, a two two week camp up at Redwood Park, just um, Auckland West a little bit, where the golf club is. Yeah, yeah, and we were studying, uh, practicing for something, and, and um, we had little quartets and played in the band, and uh, and then we, um, yeah, I don't exactly what we we're working for, but we we're working for something. But um, uh, then another highlight was a bus trip down to um, Gisborne, I think, if that's where the Blossom Festival was, and a three. Three, three, um, a three-mile walk, and playing some of the time um, with the parade all the way along. The Hastings must be the Hastings Blossom Festival, was it? Oh, Hastings, yeah. Well, yeah, I think it was Hastings. Yeah, I'm not sure. Yeah, uh, um, yeah, that, that that was a good, uh, good little trip away. Um, uh. Um, yeah, I, I I like playing um, at, at um, Easter Easter show in Kirapay every year. I used to play the book of waltzes and nice easy music. Yeah, so that was it. Yeah, I, f I feel um, the band came 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 ahead with Brett as a conductor, and then and then when Brett had to pull out um, Peter I found Peter uh, was a fantastic conductor he knew he had so much experience he, he knew how um, what music to put up and he didn't waste time playing music that uh, some people couldn't play but, uh, but and he had a, a, him and his wife had a nice attitude 
to the band, and and, and uh, that's probably the most enjoyable time I will, will ever remember about about the band. Yeah. Uh-huh. yeah.